Alright guys, what is going on? Last time I left off in Stalker Soup, I was in Yantar, and now I'm at the bar. Uh, pretty much what happened was, for some reason my mic decided to just uh, drop off the face of the earth and not connect to my computer anymore, and I recorded a whole, like, 40 minutes going through the wild territory with no commentary. So yeah, I got rid of that, and I'm starting fresh here. Not a lot happened, there were a lot of stupid mercs, but I didn't go do the helicopter thing. I I wasn't really sure what to do, but here we are. And do I have a surprise for you? I just emptied out my inventory here. I've got these stupid documents still that I can't remove from my inventory. That I spawned in after X18, but that is not what I'm interested in here. I've got my first stash here with a whole crap load of ammo and other miscellaneous supplies. And then, oh, check out my new weapon supply here. Now, I'm sure most of you probably instantly saw this thing. That's right, the first mercenary I killed had this on him. Perfect condition, I didn't have to repair it at all. The Barrett M82 50 cal sniper. Yes, that's right, the 50 cal sniper. I got one of those finally, and uh, let's just check the model out here, shall we? Let's walk into, walk into the sun and check this beauty out. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you, you want me to shoot it, you say? Okay, yeah. Uh, deafened you, didn't I? Alright, so that's uh, that's one of the items I got. And then you'll also see I got, where is it, the QBZ, or QBZ I should say because I'm Canadian, 97. Um, a bullpup rifle here. I'm not exactly sure what, you know, what country this comes from or, or what the deal is with it, but uh, it's a pretty pretty big model again it takes up a lot of the screen so I'm not huge on that without a scope but uh, yeah not great sights either but it is a, a 556 rifle and I have now a very very big supply of 556 so it might get some use I don't know but uh, one of the things I'm uh, proud of here to present is the AKM 47 Scout this thing is a pretty sweet rifle. This is probably one of the better models I've seen. It's got an integrated silencer and one of the nicer scope models that I've seen in this mod so far. Very clear, very wide, uh, easy to use. That's what I like to see. And uh, yeah, the only problem is the lack of ammo so far. But hopefully, uh, I've got a bit of a plan for that. Hopefully I can go see duty sometime. And uh, get some 7.62, because I know they deal mostly with that sort of caliber, whereas Freedom sort of deals with NATO stuff. So anyway, that's the deal with that. That's pretty much all I was able to carry back with the, the rest of the weapons that I took with me. But for now, what we're doing is we're returning the family rifle and uh, Gordon Freeman's Desert Eagle. And I believe when you give this deagle back to him, a couple bloodsuckers attack this place. I... I can't remember where I heard that, but uh, I definitely heard that, so somebody grab some shells. I'll I'll deal with my supply afterwards. What the? Why do I have grape shot on me? I don't. Is that just what's loaded? Yeah, it is. Okay. Why am I even doing that? I'm, I'm not keeping this thing, so... Remove ammo. There we go. Just wanted to equip that, and where the hell am I going? Just wanted to equip that so I could fight any bloodsuckers that might decide to pop up. And of course got my uh, fancy new SSP-99M Vega suit, Vega suit, whichever it happens to be. But we've got some business to attend to here, so uh, depending on how long this is, I might skip through some of it. 
If it's fast, then you know I won't need to, but uh, first of all, let's give these documents to the barkeep. Deal with the Scorcher and open the way to the north. You ready to go now? Yes, I am. I'm not going to do that right now, though. Alright, alright. Yeah, this is X10. I, I think that's the name of the lab. I'm pretty sure. There we go. I'm in. Now, here's the flash drive Professor Krug gave me. Good boy, don't talk to me like that. I really don't appreciate that. And I got five grand. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. And... What's this? Alright, whatever. Okay. So, I'll talk to you after. I want to talk to this dirtbag first. Why couldn't you get that yourself, huh? Here's your rifle. Four grand. Transmutation recipe. Um. Destroy the lair of the bloodsucker. Um. Uh, military warehouses. Yeah, whatever. I'll I'll pick that job up. Sure. Do you still have that rifle on you? No, you don't. It's not a rifle. It's a shotgun. Not. Sh what the hell? Oh, yeah, you're gonna get pissed off at me if I take that, aren't you? Yeah, no thanks. Okay, and I'm gonna quick save before this, just in case things go horribly, horribly wrong. Well, I can't believe it. Gordon Freeman in person. How did you get there? Or get here? Okay, here's some of Gordon's backstory. I'm not gonna read this all. You can check it out afterwards. H hold on! I heard a guide from a man named Sidorovichovich for big money. Castle Lake, Factory Complex. Alright, alright, I'm not going to read all this. You can if you want to. I will find your gun. I have your gun. Enjoying the barman's company. Too much vodka is a good thing sometimes. I don't hear any bloodsuckers yet. Traveling my guide, reaching Rostock. What? Gem? I, 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 there's no way, like, gems? I, I cannot, I don't know what, this is why I don't pronounce these names most of the time, so yeah, I'm just gonna leave that alone. American. That's not a really American name, I wouldn't think, but okay. Um. Alright, alright, I'll go pick that up. Talk to James. Who's James? Is that is that how you pronounce his name? James? Okay. Well, that makes a bit more sense than G James. Or whatever his name was. And I need this Playboy. I'm sorry, man. Don't kill me. Thank you. Don't kill me. Thank you. Now, Bloodsuckers. Are there any up here? I don't trust them. And why am I getting irradiated? I dumped all my artifacts. I shouldn't have anything on me that's... God damn it. Oh! Titan Kalabok. Okay, well that's going right in my stash. Hold on. Titan Kalabok, you are messing my plans up. Get in there. What do you do, first of all? Not a whole lot of anything useful, that's for sure. Okay, okay. Now I'm mildly irradiated, and I keep going the wrong way here. Sorry if this is dragging on, I'm just trying to get this stuff done. Okay, what's your story? You're, you're still the quest giver here. I'm not there for your job. Um, and you, I'm supposed to talk to James. So I guess it's just a matter of finding James when I can find him, I guess. I I don't know. I could use more anti-rads. You have any on your person, Barkeep? Eh, uh, no you don't, do you? What that machete. Oh, and another thing I should note. 
Yeah, never mind. I have with me, you can see, I bought the AK-47 bayonet. Let's just check this sucker out here, yeah. So, I, I got that AKM-47 thinking that maybe there's a possibility I could attach the AK-47 bayonet to it. I thought I had an, an AK-47 in my stash here, but I don't. I must have sold it. So, unfortunately, I can't use it right now, but it turns out it does replace your knife. And I can't imagine that being any different, uh, like you can see the, the reskinned knife here. It's pretty nifty. It's a it's a cool little sort of model here. It's exactly the same animation. But yeah, I, I can't imagine it working any differently when it's on the gun. You're probably going to be holding the gun and then stabbing with it. I can Im I, I'm only speculating here, but I'm pretty sure that's how it would work. So now I am going to skip past this. I'm just going to get a, a, a good loadout going here, and then I'll catch you guys when I'm finished. All right, uh... I think this should be a decent loadout. Um, I'm keeping that 47 bayonet with me just in case I run into one here somewhere. I can test it out. So I'm going to pack light here. I'm just planning on going to... Please don't tell me I'm still getting irradiated. Come on, don't... God damn, what is... Oh, I think I know what the deal is here. Let me just empty out my artifacts here. Get rid of these things. I'm kinda tired of this radiation. Alright, is that good finally? I don't see it going up anymore. Okay. So yeah, all I'm packing with me is the AN-94 and the Mossberg 590. That's all I really think I need at the moment. All I'm gonna do is, first of all, see if I am... Uh, I am allowed to be let into the duty camp here without getting shot at. I hope so, because I want to trade with uh, your trader here. Come on, man. I, have... uh, I need to talk to Petrenko. Um... Oh god damn it, don't send me there. <sighs> I miss you and want an artifact of the ladies, of these, from the new transmutator. Oh god. What the hell? Before we let you in, I want to... Okay, good. Yeah, no shooting. I get it, okay? You can pass. Finally, God. So uptight, dutiers. Jeez. Okay, now please have some... 762 on your person. I can't remember your name. I think it's Skinflint, but it could be... That could be the Freedom Trader. Or it could just not be him at all. Petrenko. Never mind. It's... I don't know where I got Skinflint from. Okay, what do you have on you? 762 by 51 762 by... Ah, oh, damn it! I want some just plain 762 by 39 Ah... Uh, well, you do have these crossbow things. Not interested, though. No, I don't... I don't care about any of this EOTech optical sight. You've got some more 50 cal on you. No. Well, damn it. And, okay. My screen just randomly went bloody. That's great. You holding on to me over here? Got anything worthwhile? No? Oh, no. Don't freeze. Don't freeze. Please don't. Unfreeze. Unfreeze. Alright, so the game froze up for about a minute or two when I just ended it. I think Fraps may have been part of the problem. I'm not sure. I'm just speculating on that front, but I am using the new Fraps. And I'm a little weary of it. Uh, I think it might be 
crashing the game a little bit here. I don't know. I'm not going to assume anything, though. Just going to go in and talk to... Now, I think this guy is... Is it Veronin? I don't, I don't know the names anymore. Yeah, it is Veronin. Okay. The military warehouses. You want the RG6. Yes, I know. I'll get one from Freedom. They're dumbasses. They won't be looking. Um... Yeah, whatever. I'm I'm gonna go to the Freedom uh, Freedom base now in the army warehouses. Um, Petrenko didn't have any any 762 by 39 on him, which kind of blows. But whatever. I'll I'll see if Freedom has any. They sometimes have some decent ammo. What the hell? What is this creepiness? Oh god. That's a little disturbing. Okay. Yeah, this is more my type of music here. Who are you guys? Oh, you're just loners. Different armor, I guess. And I went the wrong way. I always get scrambled up in these parts. And, okay, good. I thought it was going to freeze again. Jeez. It always gets skippy around these uh, these parts of the bar area. Alright, let's blow this joint. And let's check our map here. I'm just thinking... I'm wondering if I can go back... And talk to what's his name, the doctor in Strelok's secret hideout. Because I know, I think you have to get to a certain. I thought it was X16 you had to beat to go uh, get access there. Not sure though. Oh, there's James. Okay, well I'll go see him after. I'm not progressing any farther than the than the army warehouses. I'm not, you know, going to the radar or anything yet. I just want to go uh, hit up the Freedom guys, get some quests from them, do some stuff in the army warehouses, such as, you know, uh, dealing with the Bloodsucker Village. Fun stuff like that. And there is sometimes a Chimera here. So I'm going to play it safe, get the hell on top of this van. Um, I don't see anyone yet. Why am I so hungry all the time? This is ridiculous. I keep having to eat. Alright, I don't... I don't see anything, but you can never be too careful. Alright, lots of pleasant anomalies along the way. First of all, let's just break open these boxes and see what's inside. Uh, more artifacts that will give me radiation. Oh, grenades. Okay. Well, that wasn't all... all bad. What's this? Slime. I already have a few of those, don't I? Well, I'm kind of just saying that out loud because I know I have a few of those. It's not like there's any question here. And what's this? Another one of those things. Oh, great. Something sees. Oh, yep. There's the Chimera for sure. Get up there. Get up. Yeah, I know I'm being a little fraidy cat, but whatever. Okay, get out here, you stupid Chimera. Come on. Let me reload my rifle first. Yeah, I know I'm being a little Nancy. I'm sorry. Oh, wonderful. At least I have a lot of bandages. Okay, show yourself, Mr. Chimera. Uh-oh. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I can't friggin' see here. Okay, what kind of foulness is this? There's an Electro one right there. Yes, I heard that. And there's that stupid thing. Okay, now Chimera. Hello? Don't leave me hanging, bud. 
Oh, now we've got an Islam. Where are you? Hold on. Hold on here. Just chill the hell out for a second. I'll be right with you. I just want to get this done the easy way. Oh. Oh. There we go. That's the easy way. Probably... Oh, god damn it, no. I'm not gonna bother using a bandage up. There's no point.